Hey, uh, my name is Da Vinci Sekanek, and I got third at Dragon Duels Nationals in 2019. I am playing Orcus Gar Dragon. So okay. for so for the Orcus engine, I play pretty standard. Um, two heart, two skeleton, two Orcus Nightmare, one wand, and the obvious um, thing that you want to set with Galatea, the Babel and the Crescendo. The reason why I didn't want to play Free Harp is because since we're playing Guard Dragon, we run more bricks because we're running combo pieces that we don't want to draw. So we wanted to minimize the Monster Engine to 7 with the Wand. And that's all for a... Mm. What do you like to set off turn 1? Turn 1, Crescendo. And then next turn I do Babel and I grind with the... Um, Bordish and uh, Dengusu pop two times. It's amazing. But it's like Rage with Salmon Great. For our Danger Engine, we play Free Nessie. This card is amazing. Free Jackalope. Um, they're both special summons. Free special summons. So it works for the deck. Then we have Two Snake. Um, this is what they do, but I would probably run free if I had a third one. But running two is fine. And I got the Run Chip Cabra. Um, the one is fine. I think I should have made a Bigfoot, just to out, um, floodgates or monsters that I don't necessarily want to have on field, that they have. And I thought for the Danger Engine, this was amazing over the weekend. Helped me play through boards. And then, obvious, um, Phantom Light Engine. Without this, I would lose two negates and the Dengusu pop. Did you ever miss the cloak? Yeah. I should have ran the club, but um, I forgot to. And every time I drew this, it, it really it was dead. Or I just run it back with Saruja. But you, I can't depend on sp spending it back with Saruja. And that then you get Saruja, then I probably just lose. And then we put the Crusader engine, free Crusader, to Draco, and one Maximus. Um, this card was amazing. It was amazing and sound great. I summoned it to Summit Wolf, popped their set, and then I played my turn. Two Draco for a Sparfa play. When you move it, when you summon LP, move it, and then do Brotar. The one Maximus is because it's a light. The, and, so you said you special Reclusia uh, and, and, and or Draco or Maximus to the zone that uh, Summit Wolf points to, correct? Yeah, so we don't have to use our normal summon. Stay at Hurt that they got to add? The uh, gazelle? Not really, because our board is way too much for them. And we're probably just going to kill them anyway. Okay. So. Fair. Um, the light is because our deck is dark, but we run Orcist. And um, it's the reason why we run it. It's also a good one of. And then for the guard dragon part, the dragons that bring out the guard dragons anyway. Free Wiven Burst and two black. Running free black well, gets cloggy because we're running Orcus again, and we don't have that many light monsters. So running free Wooden Burst and two of this was fine. And then we have the two of in here, one in all my matches. Would you play three? Um, probably not, because every hand I just had a way to get to it. And if I ran free, it would probably get too cloggy and too bricky. And like I said, running unnecessary bricks because the girl dragons we run like Brotar and Goliath and Diablos. We don't want to drop like bricks and then we add a third one we'll probably get a little bit too bricky. But we have the danger so I don't know. The two Diab uh, one Diablos, one Brotar, one Goliath. Um this engine is amazing. Brotar won me games oh most of my games just because Destroy it by battle, summon it, discard, add a in here. It's amazing. Sometimes I even um, crash my own monster. If they ash my mermaid, I'll just go crash, summon Omni Dragon, and get a in here by discarding a card. And then I'll just destroy their board. Goliath is for the Heretic Link. It's really good against Sky Striker, Salmon Grape. This is a free flood get yeah. off the Heretic Link. Uh, did you miss Eclipse Swimmer? No, not really. We tested it, and we it's an unnecessary extender that we don't need because all we need is summon this, and then we get this. That's all we need. This is for the, the second rip, if we can do it. And um, good against Sky Striker. Summon it. Hard to get rid of. The only way for you to, for they to get rid of it is they jam away the set, which I probably won't have any, but I activate Crescendo turn one. And then, um, 
hand traps. That's all I need. Card good. Good against Salmon Great, Sky Striker. Would you play three? Um, probably not because I draw it enough. Since um, yeah, I just I draw like every game, and if I play three, I'll probably draw two, and then that would really suck. Um. So you played two in the off chance that you won't draw it off the draw yeah. two. Okay. And then the 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 card that made me win every single game, three format skipper and a one for one. So what does format skipper do? So it reveals the card from my extra deck, and then it copies its name, attribute, and typing. So I can reveal Phoenix. It becomes Phoenix's name again, Nightmare, and then it can summon Mermaid. They can't gnome it, so then they'll sign gnome. They'll uh, attempt the gnome, the format skipper, and then they can't. So then I can just do my or whole Orcus combo. Or I can reveal LP and then you become a LP or Pisty Flutter for the Guard Dragons. And then, the, so you're technically playing four because of the one mm -hmm. for one. Okay. And one for one is also for the Omni Dragon. If I draw these two, if they negate this, I just have an Omni Dragon. Um, do you go Phoenix. full ham. Yep. Um, that's it for the main deck. For, uh, uh, how many in the main deck? I think 42 to 44, about around that. I'm not completely sure, but would, I forgot. In the future, would you want to cut it down towards 40? Probably. Or was it consistent? It was pretty inconsistent. I barely bricked. The only time I bricked is when I drew just five random Orcus cards. I just set Orcus, um, I mean, set Heart Pass. What was your record in day one? Day one, I went, I went X-1-1, one, one, lost to Salmon Great, got a draw with Salmon Great. And then day two, what was your record? Um, I was undefeated till um, top four. I got sacked by Mystic Mine, but Mystic Mine is 100% um, skill. Let's just say that. Uh, and, and then after that, we run uh, One Mermaid, Phoenix, and Unicorn. We didn't need the Cerberus because Cerberus... We don't need out monsters. Our problems are set, spawn traps. And like again, Ravine here broke. If Best you had the me. chance, would you play two uh, Mermaid? I would probably not because I never needed it. Okay. Because the first one, if it didn't resolve, I would just do the combo, make Surudra, and draw a Orcus Harp or Orcus Nightmare, which was um, pretty good. Then uh, for the Orcus, two Oh, we got the ulti over here. I wish I had a 4 and one but don't, didn't. Um, I got, uh, didn't use it, was amazing this weekend, especially with the Bardish play. Just pop two, it's like two, it's like Dryden. Two, um, two pops, but this then, so it's better. Um, this card, I was thinking about running one, so then I would have, like, maybe a Boar Sword or a Boar Load or Avermax in my extra deck. But running two is fine. It's actually really amazing. Because most of the time turn um when they had their turn after make my board, they attempt they attempt to destroy it, which sucks. So I just make another one, my second one, and then I set Babel, and then I ban it and then I uh, I do Dingusu, I attach the skeleton and then I pa and then link off and then pass. So now I had the Dingusu Bardish play, um, during my second turn. And then they can't play. That's all for that. The guard dragons. Pretty um, typical. Yeah. Standard. Uh, I I was trying to fit the uh, um the agrapane play in, but we didn't have enough room in it. It's kind of tight with the orchids. But TD, they don't need they don't need like unicorn or mermaid or phoenix. So besides that, that's it. And then for the regular dragon stuff, one heretic link and one a uh, triple burst. This card is absolutely amazing, same with Heretic Link, because this is amazing, it's a uh, Solemn Great, Bounce Back, Sunlight Wolf, when you summon it, summon, um, or the normal summon, summon Goliath, just win. This card is good against Sky Striker, um, that's all really uh, good for. I never use its turn to effect when I tribute it, summon a Link to from my graveyard, but these two are still amazing. Uh, that's it for those generic dragon stuff. And then the Crusadia links. One um, one Magis and one Sparfa. These two were amazing. They negated, sometimes they negated the Magis or Sparfa. And then I just did Orcus plays and then I set up my board and then pass and they couldn't play through it. Which is nice. Because that means probably I win. 
and then for the generic um the thing that goes with the guard dragon stuff the Saruja, this card's broken if they negate it then i literally just do just do orcus stuff the whole or um guard dragon is just um thing to negate so i can do the orcus stuff so with that and then that one b cut one birdish this is for the phantom knight with the dingusu play this is for the diablos and I can put a token on um, Goliath and Pass and it's sounding great, which is pretty nice. That's it for the extra deck in the main deck. Time to go for the side deck. The side, my side deck really sucked. And if I had a better side deck, I probably could have beaten a Mystic Mind better. So to start, I ran free, free Lantium. Pretty good card. I won against TD. Uh, went first one, game two. When you side this and you activate it, it's really nice because you're because then you just do your orca stuff and then make the gates and pass. So this gonna be real good this weekend. And then the best card overall was the gammas. So one me was driver better than gamma? Absolutely, man. I, I do this like every time I do this. So I went night two. But at least you contribute and to be sure. sick. Against uh Salmon Great. I just do this against their gazelle and they lose. Literally, they just lose. They can't do it much. And then, um, two spell counts were, I, I wish I ran free, but I decided not to. This card was amazing because I had somebody against Sky Striker when they negated my plays, and then I passed and I won. And then, free Black Garden. This card sucks. I, no, please don't side it. I think it's Mystic Burn. My guys were halved. I kind of forgot about that. My attacks. And then I literally couldn't kill him. And all he did was kept burning me for burn cards. So don't side this card. And it's really bad. With my experience. And then free evenly match. This card was alright. I went against Ultra Geist. Which is a kind of a bad matchup. When I evenly matched him. Um, that was a scoop for him. And I won. This card, if you use it against Sky Shaker or Artigas, it totally works. But they feel I feel like they feel 